What's going on everybody? Welcome to the video. Today's video is going to be really cool. We're going to pick up the G4 out of maintenance, fly to Van Nuys, pick up the passers, and we're going to Super Bowl 57 in Scottsdale. It was a really fun video. I'm currently sitting in a hotel in Tampa, Florida. I'm on a G550 contract trip right now. Been in Europe for the last couple weeks. It's been nutty. Um, but aside from that, we just hit 15,000 subscribers on the channel. I can't thank you guys enough for that. It's so crazy. Uh, Aircraft Spruce gift card give giveaway uh, is coming up really soon. So stand by. But for now, let's hop into this video. It was an epic weekend. Let's go check it out. Welcome back, everybody. We got an interesting episode today. It is the Friday before Super Bowl Sunday. And you know what that means. We are getting loaded up to go to the Super Bowl. So I want to talk to you guys a little bit about how this works. When there's a big event with the FAA, you have to coordinate everything ahead of time to get landing slots and permits and all that stuff. So I'm going to go in here into Air Inc. And I'm going to look at our filing status and see what my flight plans are looking like right now. Looks like we're filed out to, uh, we're heading into Goodyear, which is good. So that's going to be today. And uh, there it is. So um, basically what you do in this kind of situation is you got to call ahead to the FBO and you have to basically arrange and they give you, um, I forget what it's called, but it's like a control number or something that you have to file in conjunction when you file your flight plan. You have to give this number. Um, it's kind of like a, like a unique pin code or whatever. And that lets the FAA know that you have actual parking arrangements in Phoenix. If you don't have that, they won't give you a flight in. So you can do um, a pop and drop is where you fly in, drop your passengers off, and then you relocate the airplane somewhere else. But uh, in Scottsdale, I'm in the Phoenix area right now, every airport, absolutely every airport has this. Um, even Las Vegas has it because so many people fly in to watch and bet on the game in Vegas. So um, it's a big deal. Luckily, I was ahead of the game on this one. Uh, my friend owns Lux Air, the FBO out at Goodyear. So we're gonna fly into Goodyear and um, he's taken very good care of us and we have a lot of crazy events lined up this weekend. So I'm gonna throw a bag together really quick and uh, start headed to the airplane. So I'll see you guys from the jet as we're getting it ready. I gotta update the nav databases cause we haven't flown it in about a month. And um, yeah, that's it. We're gonna stalk it, get it ready to go. So I'll see you guys from the jet. Sitting in this horrendous Southern California traffic, it's terrible, got a, uh, plane's been in maintenance put some new tires and some I had some other stuff done to it so I'm driving out to Chino to get it out of maintenance but this is just terrible it's Friday Southern California it's gonna take me almost an hour and 45 minutes to do a flight that uh, to do a drive that normally takes me like 35 35 40 minutes sucks all right guys finally made it out to the plane after a shit ton of traffic Guys, so now that I'm here, uh, first order of business is to update the navigation databases. Haven't flown the plane in a while, so I'm gonna get into that right now. I'll show you guys how we do that. All right, we're in the plane. You can see here it says database out of date on both FMSs, so that means it's time. Now the first step is to take the USB and put it in over here, making sure the system is off. Okay, that's off. I don't know why this flashlight's on. There we go. Now, we're gonna go maintenance, data load. Power this guy on. I don't know if you guys can see down there. Okay, I'll get you in close. Try to get the light. We're gonna come back over here. We're gonna go clear that nav database. Wait for this thing to initialize. Oh, from loader to all FMSs. Yes, and there we go. Clear that message, and she'll start going. Now this takes a long freaking time to do. Usually, 
35 to 45 minutes. It's a very slow old system, but at least it's USB and not uh, floppy disks. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what the hardest part of my job is by far, 100%. It's putting the snacks in the snack tray. I have the craziest sweet tooth in the world, but I try to live my life on a pretty uh, decently strict diet. So this, especially these, this part is always the worst for me. All right, guys, welcome to the flight deck. This FMS is almost done, Com updating 98%. We're gonna fire up my co-pilots here. Got Kyle riding with That's me today. Right. We're heading out to the Super Bowl in Phoenix. It's gonna be an awesome weekend. But on that, sit back, let's get into this video. It's gonna be super awesome. See you guys from uh, Van Nuys. Okay. Start masters off. Left and right power switches are on. Aux power is off. Check in the left. Check in the right. Back to essential. Kill the APU. Fuel pumps on. Go up. Packed on. APU air off. Right pack on. Cold, cold stare. We're gonna leave this a landing, short flight. Uh, hydraulics are on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Those are good. We're set there. Flaps. 20. Speed brakes on out, watch your knees. There, up. Up. Brake bite. Up, Jack Douglas. Yep, Jar Master. It is off. Electro left, right power switch. They are on. External electric power. It is not used. Auxiliary electric power. It is off. Uh, battery ammeters. Checked. Central DC bus power source. Uh, left auto main. Emergency power doors. Armed and closed. anti ice switches. Uh, all on. Cow wing anti ice Not needed. Cabin pressurization control. Uh, uh, landing auto ADC one. Fuel boost pumps. All on. Ground spoilers. Checked. Stall barrier. Checked. Flight controls. Checked. Yaw damp. On. Nose wheel steering. On and guarded. Pedal steering disconnect switch. Don't have it. Auxiliary hydraulic pump. It is armed. Brake anti-skid switch. Checked. Seat belt. Good. Call for taxi. All right. Everything's on. Uh, warning inhibit is on. Okay, here we go. You ready? Yeah. 
What do you want? What do you want? Sent into Phoenix right now without the window. Can't see anything. Let's try that again. Still can't see anything out there. Um, that's it. Super easy flight. It's like hour and 18 minutes, something like that. Uh, we're gonna land the plane, put it away, and we're headed straight out to uh, Scottsdale and go have some fun. All right, guys, that's it. Time to shut the airplane down. Just got to Phoenix. We are out of here. Bye-bye. All right, here we go, guys. We're out of here. Straight to the hotel. Time to go get into it. What do you say? Oh, let's go. <laughs> yes, we're out. All right, guys. Just arriving to the Airbnb. Every hotel is sold out in Phoenix right now. Somehow, Yo. we found this gem. Sick. Yeah, this house is, oh shit, this house is rad. Okay, how do we get in? 9889. Check mark. Oh my god. Dude, this is crazy. I think there's a pool, there's a pool table in here somewhere too. <laughs> Whoa. Holy crap, guys. End of a crazy weekend. This house is absolutely mental. Super Bowl was nuts. Ran into a lot of good friends out here. That's it, gotta say goodbye to this gorgeous house. It's so crazy. All right, everybody, welcome back. There's beautiful Gulfstream. She is absolutely ready to go. This was such a crazy weekend. Super Bowl was nuts. We're gonna get into the flight. We got a really quick one hour flight home. It's gonna be nice and easy. Leaving out of the Phoenix Goodyear Airport, headed back to Van Nuys in Los Angeles. Plane's all set up, co-pilot's here. I'm ready to go. We're gonna get into it shortly. Can't wait. guys there you have it super uneventful flight on this one super fast um, nothing really going on it's a quick easy trip to Phoenix we're almost back home now we're gonna go ahead and put the plane away and I got a big video coming up next we're headed to Europe in a Phenom 100 should be an interesting crossing all right guys that's it just got back to Van Nuys planes gonna park here for a couple of days and we're out of here um, like I said, I'm doing that flight down to, uh, I'm doing the flight 
to Europe in the Phenom 100 with Kyle in a couple days. This plane's gonna go on to uh, Salt Lake City, unfortunately. It's gonna be the first time this plane has flown in a couple years without me being on it, so. It's kinda like watching your kid go off to school their first day of kindergarten or something, that's how I feel, so. Um, but I'm sure it'll work out. I got a good solid crew on the plane that day and uh, everything will be good. So I will definitely see you guys from the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. You know what to do. Um, comment, tell me that I'm a crappy pilot or I'm ugly, whatever you gotta do. Thanks guys.